This is our shot, Virginia. I'm Dr. Danny Avula with the Virginia Department of Health, here for Mythbusters, Ask the Experts. So people ask a lot of questions about the safety of this vaccine and if it's gonna have a long-term impact on them. We have never had a scenario where this many people have received uh, COVID vaccines. We've had over 300 million doses administered in the United States. We have had so much data to show us that the vaccine is both safe and effective. This vaccine has built on technology that has evolved over the last 20 years. The way to, that we've learned to use different vaccine platforms and deliver in a way with minimum side effects but maximum effectiveness, we've never seen anything like it. So we often get asked if people have underlying conditions, should they get vaccinated? And the answer is a resounding yes. In fact, it's even more important for people with underlying conditions to get vaccinated because they're at higher risk for the complications of COVID. The only reason a patient shouldn't get vaccinated is if they have a known allergy to one of the components of the vaccine. But if they've got underlying conditions like diabetes or heart disease, they should absolutely get vaccinated. We do hear a lot of concerns about whether this vaccine impacts fertility or not. And that rumor has been circulating on social media. We understand why a lot of people have raised concerns about that. But over and over, the studies have shown that there's absolutely no connection between getting vaccinated and your fertility.